feel what it is you want. Oh my God. Getting acquainted with the personality is to the benefit of the demonic spirit because it allows the demonic spirit or the demon to develop a strategy to avoid offending you as the owner of the house. And in many, uh, in many cases, demons have learned how to gain control by studying the personalities. Now, I don't have time to talk about the doors, the portal, the thief, the robber, and the stranger. But these are all kinds of spirits that operate in the realm of the spirit. I don't have time to talk about divination and necromancy and magic and sorcery and witchcraft and astrology. I don't have time to talk about the demons that are mentioned in scripture that move against us. Wow, we are striving to walk with God. But what I did come here to tell you is that God has given you power. I I'm out of here, y'all. Uh, look at your neighbor say, neighbor. The Apostle Paul said, and I agree, I might not have an education. I might not have enticing words. I may not be philosophical, theological, Christological, New Logical, soteriological, but one thing I have is the power, I feel it here, of the Holy Ghost, and because I got power, no weapon, shake your neighbor's hand from the second to the last time, and say, oh neighbor, I got power, and because I got power, no weapon formed against me, and tonight, I'm going to utilize my power to get every demon out of my life, out of my house, out of my emotions, out of my soul. Open up your mouth and shout glory. Shout hallelujah. Come on, say I got power. I got power. Can I preach it like the old folk? Shake your neighbor's hand. Say, neighbor, I got power. What kind of power? Power to walk right. Power to talk right. Power to love right. Power to live right. Power to resist the devil. Power to cast him out. Look at him. Say, neighbor, if you're in trouble, I'm the one to get the devil out of your life. Because greater is he that is in me. The power and every demon that's been messing with my mind. I'm evicting that demon. I'm out of here. I'm out of here. Lust, I evict you. Low self-esteem, I evict you. Depression, I evict you. Poverty, I evict you. How can I evict them? Because it's my house. I'm the owner of the house. And I got to get them out so that the Spirit of God can come in. And when the Spirit of God comes into my house, he won't share his house with another. I'm out of here. Shake your neighbor's hand for the last time and say, neighbor, I was a roommate. 2019, but I got my own house in 2020. Ain't nobody staying in here. Ain't no man worthy enough to stay in my house. If you can't put a read, y'all not saying nothing. Ain't no woman worthy enough to stay in my house. The witch can't stay here. The warlock can't stay here. Voodoo can't stay here. Voodoo and Kanye can't stay here. Obeya can't stay here. White magic can't stay here. Black magic can't stay here. Because whom the sun sets free is free indeed.
Can I have two more minutes? Look at your neighbor. Say, neighbor, tonight I'm doing a spring cleaning. You know when you do a spring cleaning, you lift up the sofa and you sweep everything that's been under there for days and months and sometimes years. When you spring clean, you wipe around the toilet all in the bath. When you spring clean, you wash all of the pillows and all of the laundry. You get every aspect of your house. Look at your neighbor say, neighbor, whatever's been hiding tonight with the power of the Holy Ghost, I'm going to find it. And when I find it, I'm going to evict it because victory is not going to be mine. But it's all. And tell them I'm free. Tell them I'm free. Tell them I'm free. Listen, I'm preaching to myself just like I'm preaching to y'all. Point at yourself, say, Johnny ain't gonna live here no more. Lisa ain't gonna live here no more. Tanisha, I'm getting them out of my house. This is a spring cleaning. That holiday depression. Every time Christmas comes, I get depressed. Get out of my house. Every time my ex passes by my house, I go into brokenness. But I'm evicting the memory of my ex. I'm out of here. But touch your neighbor and say, neighbor. And buy a thank you card and mail it to your ex. And when they open it, make sure you write on it. Just leave it to say thank you. Because when you left, God came. When you left, joy came. When you left, power, 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 shout glory. said in the Holy Ghost, give me my house back. Give me my house back. When you own the house and somebody's in your house that you don't want there, you can go down to the constable. They'll give them 72 hours. Are you hearing what I'm saying? You know, it's a 30-day process before the paperwork. But once you get the paperwork, they got 72 hours. That's true. If they don't leave, you can go in your house and put all their furniture on the side of the road. Somebody open your mouth and say, get out of my house. Get out of my house. And take with you everything you brought in. Take everything. 